I'm so happy to be back here on Ocado with you, bringing you my sensational summer salad. Sorry about the immodest title. And it starts off with the Nicardo organic chicken, which I'm spatchcocking. There are probably sleeker ways of doing it, but I find this easiest. Kitchen scissors, cut out the spine, just press down. Don't go anywhere, I just have to wash my hands. I've left the backbone here because it adds so much flavor to the juices later, and I'm gonna aid those by adding some plump, unpeeled, very easy, garlic cloves, some gorgeous mellow yellow oil with its slightly mustardy bite, and a good scattering of sea salt flakes. But the last touch, and this makes a difference, some water from a freshly boiled kettle. I shall just roast that in a 220 oven, and I prefer not to use a fan oven here because I want as many of these gorgeous juices as possible. And I shall be back for the next part. Look at this, crisp skinned, glorious and golden. Just squeezing the garlic cloves out of the skin and they're wonderfully caramelized and sweet tasting, not at all fierce. Juices go to this bowl to make a sauce. It's a many layered affair, my sensational summer salad. One of the most wonderful layers is the bulgur wheat. Some mellow yellow oil, zest, an unwaxed lemon. I'm using parsley in the salad. Beautiful. Citrus sharp and herbal fresh. A whole packet of Ocado bulgur wheat. That's 500 grams. Give it a good stir just so it gets slicked with the aromatic oil. So for 500 grams of bulgur wheat, I want 750 mils of cold water. Some salt. And as soon as this comes to a bubble, I shall clamp on the lid, turn the heat down slightly, and leave it to cook for 15 minutes. Time's up on the bulgur wheat. I have a special fresh tea towel to drape on top and then clamp the lid back on and then the bulgur wheat will fluff up beautifully. That's it. You find me with a bowl of cooled and gorgeously fluffy bulgur wheat and a sort of enchanted circle of wonderful things to add to it. Some courgettes, just diced, quartered cherry tomatoes, some beautiful radishes, walnuts just broken roughly, and these are some chopped pickled walnuts. Mix everything together. I put the chopped parsley stalks in at the beginning of the bulgur wheat, and now I've got the leaves. And if you think it needs it, and I do, you can add some more salt. There's a lot of bulgur wheat here. So, the crowning glory, the basil sauce I promised you. These are the chickeny garlicky juices in this bowl, completely cold. Some M&S 10% fat, don't go for the skinny one. Greek yogurt, a little bit of lemon juice, and a bit of a whiz up. That's looking uh, absolutely wonderful. Right, she'll park that for a moment and start a layering up. The last little bit. Right, she'll add the bits of chicken, making sure I've got gold skin as much as possible. Ah, lovely. I have got what I call a salad garland, and it's just some Dolce Romana lettuce, which I adore, tossed in some lemon juice oil and grated parmesan. I just want that just to go all around the perimeter. 
I shall dribble and daub this fragrant basil sauce. And you can find this recipe exclusively on Ocado.com. Beautiful.